Well, hello there, Minecrafters. I'm hanging out, flying around in a creative world here. Uh, and I have a little bit of a different uh, video for you here. This is um, a custom map, more like a, a redstone build. A guy named Dragonsloth sent it to me, and uh, originally I thought, uh, how can I really... I don't know how I can kind of showcase this, but it's, it's a really fascinating um, build. It's called Conway's Game of Life. Now, when he when he told me it was the game of life, I was thinking, oh, like with the spinny thing and the cars, and you get married and have fourteen kids, and now it's not that game of life. It's a different game of life where um, it's made by a guy named John Conway. I think he was a physicist or a mathematician or something. And basically, there are some rules, and the game is played out on this kind of grid pattern here. We'll take a closer look. Uh, here is. Uh, there are five by five in this version. I've seen larger ones, but uh, here's the. See, we have one, two, three, four, five, and then five going down. And I've never seen one in Minecraft that had this many lights. It's each each one looks like it's five by five lights. So it's a huge, huge build. And the the really crazy thing is uh, he uses over 450 command blocks. He says in the back. I've seen it. It's pretty crazy. It's pretty awesome. It's it's a phenomenal build, but just to show you how it works, um, first before we get into that, it's the game of life is made up by a few rules it's supposed to simulate life or uh, patterns. I think mathematicians are really uh, interested in it. And basically, what happens is if you have one uh, light on or one section on, and you have nothing around it, so nothing touching it it'll die and if you have one touching it it'll die if you have two touching it it'll stay lit and then if you have three touching it it'll stay lit and then if you have more than three it'll die and then if you have three but that one's off it'll come back on in the next sort of round so each time a light comes on it simulates another surrounding so this one goes turns that one on then this one's uh, activating the other ones while this one's activating blah 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 hard to explain but I'll just show you how it works I'm just gonna make a um, an infinite version here if I do the uh, three middle ones and I press his start button and we watch it here it it will uh, it'll constantly flip back and forth kind of like a plus sign because it, the game is following these rules every time each light has its own separate rules so, um, yeah, it's a pretty pretty crazy build. I'm going to show you the back here. Uh, look at this. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That is fantastic build. Like, it's amazing. A lot of work in that. So many command blocks, so much redstone. He used a lot of colored wool, too, to, I guess, easier to keep track of. I don't know how much work you'd have to do. And he's got this stuff here. I don't know if they're clocks or whatever. It's just, oh, so crazy. And then back here, he's got some other stuff. I'm not even going to begin to explain it. But, uh, you know, it might be interesting to you if you're into math or uh, patterns. These buttons here say work in progress. I'm not sure what he has there. And I couldn't really figure out what these were. But then I saw, don't mess around with this. It's the manual control. So I'm just going to stop it and do, like, kind of, what I like doing is just hitting all the buttons that I can randomly and see what we uh, end up with. Let's see, boom, 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 and then uh, hit the start button. And in the bottom left there it says we're starting. We're starting some patterns. Come on, baby. There we go. And then it flips around, and uh, I've seen bigger ones of these. If you uh, search YouTube, you can find some really, really crazy big ones. People, There's actually, they call it a glider. It's a popular image that will self-replicate, look like it's moving across the grid. But, yeah, excellent job, man. Like, it's it's pretty phenomenal. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys this and, and use this to kind of show your design off. And uh, maybe work on a bigger one. That would be awesome. But uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the little look at Dragonslav's uh, Conway's Game of Life. And uh, when uh, the planet Minecraft becomes uh, stable again, I'll, you can download it if you think it's pretty cool. Or I'll leave whatever link it is so you can get it. 
And but good work. Great job. Thanks for letting me look at it. Have a great day.